this extremely tiny thing here on my finger, which is probably one or one, one or two centimeters long, is a pupa of a silk moth from the Saturnidae family. It's remarkable because Saturnidae are usually very large species, even for a butterfly or moth. In relative terms, they are half small and big, but Saturnidae are often the absolute biggest. So the small size of this one is very surprising. It's probably the smallest Saturnidae pupa I've seen. And it's going to hatch into Dreocampa rubicunda, the rosy maple moth. I've reared some in captivity. And here, here we can see some pre-pupa. They're pupating on paper because paper is nice and comfortable for them. Here we see an empty skin. Uh, this is the larva that sheds skin into this pupa. And, well, they're just very tiny larvae, even for being fully grown and being pre-pupal. Here we see a very fresh pre-pupa, which still has colors. Let me just put my finger here near them, and you'll see how small they are. It's very small for this family. So stay tuned, because I am very excited for the moment they'll hatch. I'm going to read many more of these, so expect many videos of rosy maple moths in the future.